Welcome back, guys. I have been very, very busy. I'm going to set this um, going on fast. There is a lot to show you. Uh, where do I start? Okay, first of all, um, I'm going to pause it for just one sec while I zoom in. Uh, I've changed the cooking to cook lavish meals forever. Details are drop on the floor, cooking skill nine, and don't allow rotten. Set that up on both benches. Um, although, you know what, I temporarily, temporarily, I'm going to suspend this bench, I think. Yeah, I'm going to suspend this one. Because I, I want as many people out doing other stuff. You'll see, there's a lot for them to do. I have, I, I, we're focusing on the defences. I want to finally get the defences sorted out. I've asked them to take out all the graves except Ugly Bobs over here. And I've asked them to get rid of all the graves over here. We have a new defensive layout going in up here. We're going to mine out this air, this strip along here so people can come in from both sides uh, with an entrance here. And then we're going to set up a kill zone here. Uh, I've asked them to take out these traps so we can seal this off. We're setting up a series of airlocks through here so our people can get out. And these are, um, these are plasteel auto doors, right? So they're very tough to get through. Our people are going to get be able to get in and out very very easily because they're auto doors, so they'll just run straight out. But uh, other people will be you know, coming through here instead. Um, and we're going to well, I'm going to do some stuff in here, and you, you'll see, you'll see. Uh, over here, we need to extend this wall across here, which is why I'm getting rid of these graves. We'll reinforce this. This is going to be I don't know. This is going to be at least three deep, probably more, probably four or five deep. And the same with this wall over here. I'm going to build this up uh, to, to reinforce it. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? So let's let them get on with that. They're really getting on with getting these graves dug out. That's excellent. Oh, they're getting all of this stuff disassembled. Excellent. So we can set up the new array of guns. They're mining this out. Excellent. Um, they've got to finish off the last bits of this and then they've got the need to get to work on this defensive arrangement over here so there's there is a hell of a lot for them to do let's hope they can get through it before we get another raid would be kind of nice especially now I've taken all the traps out and stuff uh, I'm also filling in like any there was, a, there was a little gap in the mountain here a little gap in the mountain here I'm filling those in because I don't want them mining through these areas so this is going to be this is going to be a lot of work it's going to be pretty intense so yeah now where's the I'm trying to find the I'm trying to find the growing zone there it is there's the growing zone I'm going to scale this growing zone back because I've been looking in here we have got lots and lots and lots of hay in here already so we're going to scale this growing zone back a bit so let's go to uh, zone and delete zones let's, let's scale that well back yeah yeah that's fine that'll do okay we're going to be reinforcing this wall around here as well but we'll, we'll kind of start up here uh, we've got the marriage spot out there. Yeah, that probably needs to get moved, maybe. And I could, you know, I could put a moisture pump in over here. That'd be kind of interesting. Now, I've not, I have, I tell you now, I haven't used a moisture pump before. Um, where's the moisture pump? Here we go, moisture pump. Do we put in a, do we put in a moisture pump? there or maybe there kind of an idea I'm probably going to end up extending this wall across here so like maybe we should put it like over here and start drawing this area out yeah it's an idea you know what we'll get to that later I think <clears throat> oh look at the guys go they've got the mining done Right, so people can get through here, people can get through here, 
and this is our entrance. This is our entrance to the kill zone. Right, let's get the rest of this sorted out. So, um, I've I've got these guns being moved into place and some new plasteel guns being put into place. So, what I need to do... Well, col whoa, 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 what the hell? Colonists need to rescue? What the hell's wrong with Quinn? What is wrong with you? Oh, he's hammered. <laughs> he's absolutely hammered. Oh man, is um Oh Sky's Sky's gonna Sky's gonna sort him out. Good job, Sky. Yeah, get him put into bed. Get him to, tell him to sleep it off. Alright, so um yeah, what the hell was I gonna do there? I was gonna do something. I was gonna do something important then. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna do this, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's go to security and we'll finish off putting in the uh, putting in the sandbags around these new guns. Uh, oh, now, that's in the wrong place. That's in the wrong place. That should be one further over. Reinstall there, please. Yeah, good. Oh, they're starting to get this done. Excellent. Now, I've put a, I've put a power conduit up here, but I'm thinking that it would be a smart move to put in another power conduit. So I've got this power conduit going round here and up here. But I think it would actually be a smart move. Let's see. One, two. Whoa. The hell was that? Oh, we've got a, a short circuit. Okay. Uh, well, this, this actually is a good illustration. I want to start getting, like, doubling up on our connections. So I want a connection across there. And I want it to go all the way out to there. And it goes up one, and it goes up one, and then it goes up one, and then it'll double connect to there. So if we get a short in here, this will still work. Uh, and that's kind of important, because this needs to work all the time, or pretty much all the time. Right, so, um, yeah, I've just put, oh, yeah, I need to put that back in. And the same, like, here, ideally. Um... I don't know, maybe, maybe do something like that. All right, cool. That'll do. Right, get on with it, guys. Get on with it. Move these guns and get the fire out. Toby's on the job. Creepy Sam's on the job. Oh, here they come. They're all waking up now. They're getting up. Get the fire out. Good. Awesome. Now, that is down to ooh, ooh, 214. Where is Sky? What are you doing? He's using the telescope. Don't use the telescope. Repair that. There we go. And what are you going to do now? He's going to build a granite wall. No, you're not. No, you're not. You're going to move that. Oh, that's, that's a new one. That's a new one. Uh, okay, I'll tell you what. First, move that. Oh, now where are you? He's going to go off and build walls over there. I'd rather he was doing this stuff. Uh, that's a new turret. Yeah, all right. Let's let's have Sky doing that. So Sky, where are you? There you go. All right. Work on that. Let's get this. Let's get these freaking defences in place. Uh, security. We need to put sandbags around this guy like that. Right. So then we want the same arrangement on this side. So there and. there and another one there cool I like it I like it although I'm looking at this I'm thinking we need we, uh, I don't know no no it's actually a pretty good line of sight through there yeah I suppose we could trim it back one more should we trim about one more S trim about one more then so what I want orders and let's Trim that back one more. There we go. Right now, um, what are we going to do in terms of uh, bringing them in? Now over here, I set up this um, this stockpile here. We want the same kind of thing in here, so we're going to put in. Let's see, uh, 
dumping stockpile, zone area, dumping stockpile. We're going to put a dumping stockpile in. Like that, I think. Yeah. Boom. And we'll set that to be uh, priority critical. Clear everything. We just want, uh, in fact, we just want stone chunks. We don't want steel slag because we want to use that ourselves. Over here, what's this one set to? Let's have a look. Yeah, exactly the same. All right, cool. Get on with it, guys. Whoo, man. Now they've got a whole load of corpses to haul and cremate. Brandywine's doing that. Good job. So we're getting, we're getting the corpses sorted out, sorted out. We're getting our guns moved. Although we, it looks like we've got one extra. Uh, oh, oh, we can build miniguns now. Nice. Oh, we've got one colonist idle. Hunt a billico. We need some animals to hunt. Who's that? Is that Howard? No, it's Grizzly Bear 1. Um... Uh, Ooh, oh, oh, yeah, well, there you go. Problem solved. Problem solved. Go hunt them. And you can hunt that alpaca as well. Why not? And any more ostriches around? No, just the one. Hunt that ostrich as well. That'll keep you out of trouble. Right, that's how he's got plenty to do. Need a research project. Research. Uh, didn't research those. Fine, cool. All right. Next. Who's got a poor mood? What a surprise, it's arty. Who's on a booze binge? Oh, Quinton Quill's on a booze bin, a booze binge. Uh, oh, no, that was before, wasn't it? Yeah, and we fixed that. All right, cool. All right, we're, we're kind of getting there. We're kind of getting there. Okay, this airlock is pretty much done now, which is sweet. Okay, so uh, I need to do... Yeah, let's leave it running. What the hell? Um, although... Oh, a boomer lope has self-tamed. Okay, we're selling that at the first opportunity. We've got an eclipse. That shouldn't be a problem for us. Yeah, we're getting rid of that boomer lope. We don't want a boomer lope hanging around the base. That's not going to be good. Um, right, I want to start filling this in. So uh, let's put wall there, wall there. Okay. And yeah. Yeah, to leave like that right up. Right, I'm going to extend that. And... Do I extend that? Yeah, I do. Cool. Alrighty. Right, get on with it, guys. Go, go, go. Sleep. Sleep. What's Sky doing? Well, Sky and Nanny are awake. Oh, they get some loving. Get some loving. Yep, yeah, got some loving. Well done. Well done. Oh, I can hear growling. What's going on? So look at our animals. How are our animals doing? Yeah, our animals are doing great. Uh, Boomer like one. Uh, no, restrict you to animal area. Actually, I'm going to restrict it to animal area one. Keep it out of the way. I do not want problems with that stupid Boomer lope. Right, yeah, now I've still got guns, haven't I? Yeah, so that. Let's get some of these moved. So let's move you. Uh, reinstall there. And you. Uh, reinstall. Well, have I got have I got a gun going in there? No, I haven't. Yeah, reinstall that one. Uh, over there. And that one needs to be reinstalled there. Uh, I think that leaves me one over. I'll probably end up moving that somewhere else. I might, I might have like one down here just for a bit of insurance. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Let's have a bit... Oh, no, that one just got moved. Oh, that one then. Yeah, which one's... I think that one and that one are due to be moved, aren't they? I can't tell now. You know what? Uh, Mace, can you, can you... Can you... Yeah, you can. Just move that. There we go. Right, and... Get the other one moved as well. 
there you go. Right, so yeah, so this one is spare. So I think we should move it down here, don't you? So let's do it. Let's uh, reinstall it, I, I guess. I don't know, maybe I, I, w I want it in range of this door down here, really. So I think maybe somewhere down here. Um, the thing is, I don't really want it right next to this power conduit because if it blows up then we're going to be in trouble. The eclipse is ending, which is kind of good. How about... Ah, no, we want it on this side, don't we? So that it's got a line of sight down here and it's not going to block and not going to damage these. Okay, well, how about we put it there? That work for you? Works for me. Yeah, put it there. Cool, excellent. Alrighty. I'm probably going to end up getting rid of these um, solar generators down here. Can they be reinstalled? No, they can only be de de deconstructed. Oh, Yubi's given birth. More puppies. More puppies, guys. Let's have a look. Dunk, Lacey, and Godlessness. <laughs> oh, that's going to be, I think, my new favourite puppy. Godlessness. Right, let's get them obedience trained, and we'll limit them to animal area one. Oh, we, oh, Sapphire's given birth. Veronica and Hermes. Yeah, let's get them. Let's get all the puppies kept in the safe area. Where's all the little puppies? Where are you, puppies? Where's the little puppies? Oh, there they are. Don't, don't, look. Look, all the little puppies. Ah, they're so cute. We've almost got all the corpses moved from there. We've almost... Oh, we've got virtually all the corpses moved from there. How are we getting on with this area over here? Not too bad. Not too bad. Now, that doesn't get need to get moved. That doesn't need to get moved. Or that. Or that. Or that. Or that. Cool. Excellent. Uh, poor mood. Who's in a poor mood? Art is in a poor mood. Well, what a surprise. Okay, so we've got our kill zone set up. We've got our dumping stockpile. Which we could, we, we could actually extend over to there. In fact, we need to extend it over to there. So let's do that. So, zone area, dumping stockpile, and extend that into there. There we go. That's that done. So our guns have got nice line of sight into here. Right, we're starting to seal this off. That's good. All right, let's get... Uh, I think we'll get another layer on the outside of here. Make it very unattractive to come into this area through here. Oh, they haven't done that one yet. Cool. And you know what? Let's, let's double up that wall along there and let's double up this wall inside here and there and there and there and there cool awesome our base is getting stronger <laughs> uh, have they moved that gun down here yeah we've even got a backup gun just in case somebody strays past the guns and gets down here, tries to get through our doors. We've got some cover now, which is really nice. Sweet. Right, we've got now, we've got this airlock through here, which is great. And look, they can just like whiz straight through, no problem. We need another airlock over on this side as well. So, I'm not quite sure how we're going to do it. Oh, i tell you what we could do. i tell you what, we could actually put an airlock like through there, couldn't we? Yeah, you know what? That's, that's actually a really freaking good idea. Okay, that's what we're going to do then. So, whoa, my God. Um, but I think I am going to seal that off. And maybe have the airlock so they come up here and go through there. I think that might make more sense. Uh, whoa! Oh, okay. 
Okay, this is now officially not good. Everybody has got the flu. Artie's got the flu. Chris, Hunter Billico, Nanny, Vortex, Toby, Bickety Bam, Virgil, they've all got the flu. That is really, really not good. Oh man. Uh, okay, Nanny. Oh, that's reserved by somebody else. Oh man. I was gonna, I was getting a Nanny in there like straight away. Okay, well, we've only got two medical beds. Um, I think we, I think we should actually get a couple more medical beds, like urgently. Where are we? Uh, hospital bed. So let's put in another hospital bed. Uh, let's spin it. Oh, whoops! What the hell? Spin it around and put another medical bed in there. Now it's not going to have a vitals monitor attached to it. Um, Let's have another one there. See, that's not going to be able to see the TV. That's not very good. And another one there. Right, Sky. He's tending to Virgil. Why? What the hell's wrong with Virgil? What the hell does Virgil need to be looked after? Look at his health. Oh, he's got flu. How are we doing for medicine? Uh, let's have a look. How we do for medicine? We've got eight glitter world, nine glitter world, yeah, and that's about it. Other way, other than the herbal. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, well, we'll just have to see it, guys. This could be really, really seriously bad. Cargo pods. Uh, Megatherium wool. Don't really care about. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Manhunter pa Well, we've got a manhunting pack of rhinos coming in. Okay, this is going to be an interesting test of our new defences. Um, although we haven't got all the all the refinements yet. And of course we haven't got any traps set up yet. Which I do want to get set up. But, yeah, this is going to be interesting. Let's get everybody restricted to base. Animals all get to safety. Uh, man, I'm just wondering how long this episode's been going. I think we've got flu. We've got... Let's have a look at the other cargo pods. Uh, what have we got? Ah, oh, cloth. 250 cloth. Yeah, okay, that's kind of good. Let's get the stuff falling. So, yeah, so we've got... Oh, my God, everybody's got flu. We've got a pack of wild rhinos... Racing into the base. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven rhinos attacking the base. Well, apparently I've only been going about 20 minutes. So, um, yeah, we're gonna, you're going to get to see the rhinos. You're going to get to see the charge of the rhinos. So, let's do it. Uh, let's slow this down. Which colonist needs treatment? Oh, God, lots of people need treatment. This is not good. Okay, let's go back to the rhinos. Where are the rhinos? Oh, bickety bam! You need to get your ass back in cover pretty quick. Oh, here we go! Come on, auto guns! Oh, quick bear! Get to cover! Oh, we got one rhino down. Oh, two, three. Okay, this is a lot better. Oh, and another one down. And of course, we've got this gun over here. Oh, come on, come on. Well, we've got that one down. So just this one left. Oh, run, run. Run, Julio. The rhino's trying to get to us. That's not going to work. We could probably do with another gun over here. Oh, boom! That served you right. <laughs> well, okay, yeah, we we need a couple of guns here, I think, for sure. All right, but you know what? That actually worked pretty well when you consider that we haven't got the um, 
the stuff to slow them down yet. That's actually pretty darn good. All right, then. So let's set all of these to be hunted. Those two are already down. That's going to bring us in a ton of meat. So that's like really good. Artie needs treatment. Okay, we we just need to get through this um, this flu epidemic, really. Uh, let's get these um, let's get these beds made. Now, Sky's not down with the flu, is he? He wasn't one. No, he wasn't down with the flu. What are you doing? He's consuming a lavish meal in the dining room, probably. No, no, he's up somewhere else. Where are you? He's, oh, he's going to go and consume a lavish meal. How hungry are you? He's not desperately honey, hungry. It says he, he's, he's already got a boost for eating a lavish meal. Why are you eating a lavish meal? You don't need to eat a lavish meal. Go and make one of these beds. Go on, go on uh, need materials. Oh, man. What don't we have? <clears throat> what don't we have? I don't know what we don't have, but we don't have it, so... That is what that is. Well, let's crank things up, and let's see if we can get a bit further. We've got these rhinos to shoot. Oh, uh, hang on, hang on. Restrict. Unrestrict everybody. There we go. And animals... Uh, Chaos Home, Area 2 for all the huskies that aren't puppies. The puppies should all be at home. They're getting trained. Oh, slippers. we got to do the husky puppy. Slippers. Cool. Um, yeah, they should all be in Animal Area 1. And then all the grizzly bears. My God, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven grizzly bears now. Holy crap. Let's train that grizzly bear as well. Uh, the grizzly bears go in animal area two and the megatherium. Alrighty. <clears throat> go. Go, go, go. And all the animals pile back out. Sweet. <clears throat> I've got a bit of a sore throat. I really have. Oh, finally. Finally, we've recruited Virgil. Where are you, Virgil? Now, let's have a look at Virgil. Let's have a look at his character. You are... You are, you are, you are. Um, not a fantastic shot. But he's really good. Psychically dull, industrious, heat tolerant. Can do anything. Oh, he's, he's a really good guy. Let's get him set up. So let's get you set up with the, the usual stuff. Um, no, not going get, to get you doctoring. You can flick switches. Uh, can you warden? Yeah, you can. Well, you can do some wardening. Cooking, I'm not gonna eh, I'm not gonna bother getting him. We've got plenty of people who are really up for cooking. Hunting, no, because your sco shooting skill's terrible. What's your construction skill? Not very good. Alright, you're not gonna be doing construction then. Uh you could do some growing. Yeah, but we we've already got a lot of that. What about crafting? Alright, you know what? You could do some crafting. If you're not crafting then you're going to be hauling or cleaning. So there you go. That's what you're going to... We'll, we'll name him in the next episode. I'll go and look at my list and I'll pick out a name. We really need to recruit some, some chicks. We really, really need to get some girls in. Um, that's the uh, that's the rhinos. The solar flare's gone, I think, now, isn't it? Yeah. And, yeah, we know about the diseases. So let's get rid of all the, the flu diseases. Oh, man. it's a lot to deal with. Yes, shoot the rhinos, finish them off, get them in the pot. That's what we want. And these things, how much meat do they give us? Let's have a look. These things, 270 meat. Yeah, it's not too bad, not too bad. Thrumbos give like loads and loads of meat. Do they all give the same actually? Is it all 270? Yeah, 270. Yeah, I think it's consistent. Thrumbos give like... I don't know, like 750 or something. They give, like, loads. Right, we've still got to finish off up here. Still got to finish off down this area. Well, in fact, we've got to even start this area over here. There's nothing over here. Um, oh, that's a good point. I need to finish this off as well, don't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go security and... You know, I think I'm just going to like do it the easy way. I'm just going to run sandbags, like, all across there. And there. Yeah, that'll do. 
Now, our guys have got a path, a nice path running up to there, so they can get through this and into all these areas nice and easily. Okay, so yeah, I was um, I was talking about the airlock over here, wasn't I? And deciding how to do that. Well, 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 I think, oh, we've got more cargo pods. What have we got? Oh, artillery shells, about 40 artillery shells. Mama, that's awesome. That is awesome. Did I ever redo this? I can't even remember whether I did or not. Um, no, I didn't. So this is set for weapons, and it should be set for artillery shells. Allow rotten? No. That's how it should be set up. Good. So we've got all of these people that need treatment. Vortex is starving, but that's okay. Um, you know, I, I, I really should switch Vortex and Little Sarah. I'm going to do that. I'm going to switch Vortex and Little Sarah because Jim is the guy who answers the comms console. So if he's in bed, he's only got to go from there to there, right? And it puts Vortex a bit closer to the kitchen, which would be good for him. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. So set owner, unassign them, unassign, and this is going to be Vortex. Close. And then this bed is going to be... Uh, little Sarah and Jim. All right, cool. That makes a lot more sense. There's nobody in that bed. Why is there nobody in that bed? And that's shoddy. Okay, you know what? We're going to deconstruct that bed. And we'll get a decent bed moved in there. Um, oh, Virgil's over there. Uh, is that bed any good? Yeah, that's shoddy. That's good. All right, let's get you reinstalled let's reinstall it um, let's flip it around put it there or do I just wait for that to get to you know what let's just, just get that let's get somebody to deconstruct that although everybody's gonna be busy because everybody's sick what about you Quinton he's relaxing socially well you know what how about coming and deconstruct that there you go here he comes and done so now I can go back over here go and get a nice Oh, no, no get, get a nice good bed and we'll put it up here. So where are we? Oh, no, 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 didn't want to do that. Reinstall, flip it around. There. Uh, Quinton, you know what? Go and do that as well. Get that done. Cool. And then we're going to set this. Well, pause. Oh, we've got somebody in a poor mood. Who's that? Oh, Virgil. Right, well, you know what, Virgil? This should cheer you up because you're getting this new bed. So let's have you set owner. Where's Virgil? Virgil, Virgil, Virgil. Yeah, assign Virgil. There we go. Go. There he goes. Yay! I'm here with all my new friends and I'm much happier. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at his needs. Yeah, his mood is much better. Oh, he was insulted, though. He's got serious cabin fever. But well, you need to get outside. You need to get outside. Um, yeah, they're unrestricted and stuff. All right. All right. So, well, we survived the rhinos. How are we doing with the... We've only got Artie that needs treatment, so we're staying on top of that. So that looks kind of good. We. How's our food situation? Um, I think at this point, we can now unsuspend this so that um, we start processing all of the food into meals. So hopefully we get a nice big stock of lavish meals. That would be really good. We've got more cargo pods. Oh, we've got cargo pods coming in. So, oh, 139 chocolate. The girls are going to go wild. <laughs> Let's get uh, those hauled. And we've also got rare thrombos. And we'll, we, I would love to recruit some thrombos. So, tame, tame. Let's see what we can do. And you know what, guys? We'll leave it there for this episode. Uh, things are coming along. We need to finish this side of the defenses. Come back to see that. We need to get this finished off over here. But things are looking pretty good. We need to think about this area. We need guns up in this area. Because there's kind of nothing to stop people just like tunneling through here. And I do want this to be kind of a defensive position. 
So, uh, so yeah, still lots to do. Come back for the next one. I'll catch you for that. Peace out.